Meditation 4. The Certainty of Death. We must die. How awful is the decree. We must die. The sentence is passed, it is appointed for all men, once to die. Thou art a man and thou must die. Saint Cyprian says, that we are born with a rope around our necks, and as long as we live on earth, we hourly approach the gallows, that is, the sickness that puts an end to our life. It would be madness for anyone to delude himself with the idea, that he shall not die. A poor man may flatter himself, that he may become rich, or a vassal, that he may be a king, but who can ever hope to escape death? One dies old, another young, but all at last, must come to the grave. I therefore, must one day die, and enter eternity. But what will be my lot for eternity? Happy or miserable? My Saviour Jesus, be Thou a Saviour to me. Of all those who were living upon the earth, at the beginning of the last century, not one is now alive. The greatest and most renowned princes of this world, have exchanged their country, scarcely does there remain any remembrance of them, and their bare bones, are hardly preserved in stone monuments. Make me, O God, more and more sensible of the folly of loving the goods of this world, and for the sake of them, renouncing Thee, my sovereign and infinite good. What folly have I not been guilty of, and how much it grieves me! I give Thee thanks, for having made me sensible of it. A hundred years hence, at most, and neither you, nor I, will be any longer in this world, both will have gone into the house of eternity. A day, an hour, a moment, is approaching, which will be the last, both for you and me, and this hour, this moment, is already fixed by Almighty God. How then can we think of anything else, but of loving God, who will then be our judge? Alas! What will my death be? O oh, my Jesus and my Judge! What will become of me, when I shall have to appear before Thee to give an account of my whole life? Pardon me, I beseech Thee, before that moment arrives, which will decide my happiness or misery for all eternity. I am sorry for having offended Thee, my Sovereign Good. Hitherto I have not loved thee, but now I will love thee with my whole soul. Grant me the grace of perseverance. O Mary, refuge of sinners, have pity on me. Thank you for watching. God love you.